Putting your city on the map. Understanding the phrase, be on the map. Hello everyone, today, we're diving into an interesting English expression, be on the map. This phrase is not just about geography, but it's a colorful way to describe gaining recognition or importance. Stay with us to uncover its meaning and usage. In this section, we explore the historical background of the phrase. Originally, be on the map, referred to places that were significant enough to be included on maps. This literal meaning has evolved into a metaphorical one, signifying the importance or fame of a person, place, or thing. Here, we'll see how, be on the map, is used in contemporary language. It's often used in contexts like, a business becoming well-known, their new invention really put them on the map. A person gaining recognition, her performance in the Olympics put her on the map. This section covers different ways to express the same idea, such as, make a name for oneself, or, gain prominence. These variations can be used interchangeably with, be on the map, in many contexts. We'll look at how this phrase is used in movies, songs, and literature. Real-world examples help to understand the phrase's usage in various cultural contexts. Interactive exercises to help viewers practice using the phrase. This can include fill-in-the-blank sentences or creating their own sentences using be on the map. Thank you for joining us in exploring Be on the Map. We hope this video has helped illuminate this interesting phrase and its usage in English. Remember, language is a map of culture, and each phrase you learn adds more detail to your understanding. Happy learning, and see you in our next video.